Hey, it's Rachel from FindingJoy.net, and we are on day 22 of our Finding Joy Challenge, so getting on the home stretch of finishing it. And today, because, you know, we're working on living lives with more joy and happiness, today I'm going to talk to you about grudges. I know, I know, grudges and joy, they seem like to be polar opposites, but truthfully, grudges can suck the joy out of our lives. Now, I know we just don't like to talk about grudges, but how often do we go through life holding on to a grudge or harboring resentment or remembering what that person did? And every time we see them, we're tainted with that viewpoint. Or even if we don't even see them, how many times does a grudge allow us to look at ourselves with a different light? Like we can remember like how we were treated a certain way and we don't like their attitude towards us. And even if they, it's gotten to a place where we can move on, we still allow that to define our today. It's like a filter in front of our mind. And instead of seeing the awesomeness that we do, the filter is this grudge that can kind of taint what we do in our lives. So today I'm talking about letting go of grudges and seriously working on letting them go, either in forgiving or just deciding, you know what, at this point, I'm no longer going to allow that grudge to have any um, definition on who I am as a person now. Because when we allow a grudge to sit and fester, all it does is fester and fester and fester, fester and rob us of joy. So there is a video that I will link below in the comments called Dungeons Without Doors. And it's really this idea of when we don't um, allow the grudges to let go, we are basically keeping ourselves trapped in a situation that doesn't allow for this joy and happiness. And so you hold the key and I hold the key to letting go of them. We can decide. We can decide, you know what? I'm 39 and a half years old and I've decided that I'm not going to allow a grudge in my life to have any definition on who I am today or my future tomorrow. So that's my challenge to you is to look at your life and decide, you know, is holding on to this really beneficial to who I am? And if it's not, which it's probably not, how do I let it go? And how do I push it into the past so that I can focus on being awesome and looking at my goals that I've got planned and everything that I want to do and being a blessing in other people's lives? So that's to the challenge for today. A little bit more work, but truly it will make a difference. It is a mindset thing and it will lead to more happiness and joy in your life. So I would love if you'd connect with me at facebook.com slash blog or subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I will connect with you tomorrow. Hope you have an awesome, awesome day.